The dogs and I are now on a kind of a nasty ass little road that takes off along the Gunnison River between uh, Hotchkiss and Delta, gets you to the uh, south shore of the main river and then once we get uh, to the forks we'll be on the uh, west side of uh, the Gunnison where it comes out of the canyon. You see some people have been fishing and having lunch along here on the drift boat. Uh, we're going to do a lot of waiting today. Uh, we're on our own. Sue's uh, on the staff of a casting for recovery uh, retreat at uh, the North Fork Ranch of the Platte. We're proud of her for that. Uh, she'll be gone for three days helping out women breast cancer survivors. So I'm dog sitting and uh, we're going to hope to get a little bit of decent fishing in here on the uh, Gunnison and then probably the Mother Nature's kind of thrown us a double whammy again <laughs> many times this summer. Um, I shouldn't whine. Um, about two weeks ago a flash flood came through the canyon and it really it's continued to make the water extremely murky. I've had five or six strikes from little baby browns but nothing I'd even want to hook. Uh, the second thing of course is the wind today. It's supposed to reach 35 knots this afternoon so it's not going to be easy but it's still a beautiful day without that. Pretty blue sky uh, it's impossible casting. I don't know what to do. Um, I just had a double on both little brown trout. Uh, it's just too tough. Maybe it'll be better when I uh, stream a fish my bed. Well, I'm finally playing a decent fish for more than a few seconds. It's a decent little rainbow. Could be 12 or 14. I'm going to get it in and see if I can get him released without uh, any pain. It looks like he's taking that grasshopper woolly bugger fairly deeply, but I'll be very gentle. Just threw a stick in for the doggy, and uh, lo and behold, <laughs> hooked another fish. Another one of these little bitty browns. I played a big one today, but uh, this is not one of them, obviously. <laughs> Dog's not even interested. She's a little tired. Found a place to camp in this nice river. We're right by the stream. There's not a whole lot of noise, but we don't have anybody around us either, so we're happy as can be. Well, the little one's doing her periodic screaming. She's excited. We spent a uh, relatively restful night on the Gunnison. Now we're at the uh, confluence of the North Fork of the Gunnison and Anthracite Creek, and we'll try it a little bit here if I can get the little dog. Well, hallelujah, we've got a little rainbow on. Let's ease him in slowly. Actually, it's about a foot long, so that's not a bad fish. No, I'll take it back. It's not a rainbow. It's going to be a brown. I've actually never caught a brown in this uh, stream before, but it's not a bad occurrence. Lower Anthracite Creek was pretty much a dud this morning. I had another couple of fish on and just released that one brown. So we've come over the clerk pass, uh, left the dogs in the car in the shade. Now I'm fishing the uh, crystal up near the town of Marble. It's really gorgeous up here. I mean, the scenery is absolutely spectacular with the raggeds in the background. And we'll see if we can catch a fish or two, maybe. Well, this is interesting. It hasn't been great fishing here. Marble. But all of a sudden we caught a double. Uh, the other one just popped off. This little guy is a brook trout. And he's a nice little brook 